Well, tonight police are hoping that a key new piece of evidence will solve the shocking murder of a 75-year-old woman fatally shot at a Dayton bus stop. Here is this week's exclusive Crime Stoppers report. Regional dispatch. Yeah, this is Nathan with RTA. Uh, one of our drivers uh, just saw a woman that is face down, unresponsive, northbound at Mound in Norwood. Flowers Mark, where 75-year-old Todd Gangloff was found shot and killed in the early morning hours of September 13th. It was just a half mile from where she lived at Georgetown Village in Dayton. I don't understand. I don't know. I don't know why that why that happened either. Cause she don't she don't know nobody. She don't talk to nobody. But she know people just in the building. That's it. The suspect vehicle was caught on surveillance near Germantown and Mound, and this is what it really looks like. Previous pictures made the car look a different color because of the lighting in the area. And it appears to be a newer model Chevy Cruze, possibly silver in color, but we do know that it's a lighter, newer model Chevy Cruze. If anybody has any information about this homicide, perhaps they've heard the suspects bragging about it. Um, or they may have uh, other information, please call Crime Stoppers at 222-7867. And, of course, that is also 222-STOP. You can also submit your tip online at MiamiValleyCrimestoppers.com or text the tip to TIP400, followed by your message to Crimes, which is 274637. Earn a sizable cash reward, and because of the software that Crime Stoppers uses, no one will ever know your name.